Hi, so here is series on mastering the sublime text for PSP developer. Okay, so I think investing some time to learn sublime will uh, really pay off in long run by speeding your development process. So let's start. Before moving any further, let's install package control. Okay, so if you search for package control for sublime, okay, you'll end up in this site. Okay, so if you uh, install now, click on here, you will get this. Okay, so it contains code for both Sublime Text 2 and Sublime Text 3. Okay, so uh, if you copy uh, copy this code, okay, just triple click on this code. Okay, so if you copy and head toward this Sublime and go to View and Console, where is that? Yeah, so Console. Or you can just uh, use this keyboard shortcut okay so here paste that code and enter so it will install uh, this package control okay so so after this package control get installed so you can close that by going to view hide console okay so now if you hit control shift P or command shift P on Mac and you type install okay you will get this option install package okay so first thing what we will do is we'll just make this sublime little bit uh, more beautiful okay so uh, this is okay this is default theme okay this is okay for me but you can get uh, better than this so control shift p so if you are mac you just replace control with command in most most of the case it will work okay so Control shift p and install so this is what you will be doing every time uh, when installing package okay Control shift p and typing install okay so enter now it will load the uh, repositories okay here it is showing depending on your internet and computer speed okay it will so pop up uh, the bar like this okay so these are the list of packages available so first we'll install a theme uh, called material theme so I, I personally like this theme there are several themes okay uh, like you can refer to this article okay uh, here there are different boxes this is also nice okay so I prefer this material theme so if you after that okay it will install it will take some time okay so now it is installed it will show this package control message like this so in order to activate this theme uh, you can use use command palette okay so control shift p or command shift p so this is the command palette okay you can almost do anything okay using this palette so for example i want to activate material theme okay so just type material okay so it will show all the options related to this material theme okay so here is activate theme okay so yeah so it uh, gives us option so it is uh, slightly um, broken for now you need to restart okay sublime so same thing activate theme okay so this you want darker lighter or just default one okay so now it is activated so now theme is installed and activated so if you want to alter any settings so here it is showing us these recommended settings so if you want to use them just copy this okay just copy them and go to preferences and setting user okay not default just use user so here you'll see uh, this setting this all json format okay so it is easier so here might not be comma just put comma here and paste that so now if you save this okay you'll see uh, this okay so uh, just uh, remove this setting for retina mac okay so it is uh, if you do not have retina mac so it will show this distorted kind of uh, view so i'll just remove this okay and now if you save you'll see 
uh, the normal one so in order to remove whole line you can just hit ctrl x okay so so now our sublime is looking good okay so if you see this is looking quite better than previous so next we'll learn some shortcuts okay which will really speed up your development so that's coming up next